Oh, I forgot to get video of this, but uh, this was a, a freezer I got for free from a lady who needed it removed from her shed. There was another lady who asked me if I had a freezer that she could use for dry storage. So it was an old uh, R12. So I drained the refrigerant out, took the compressor and all that out of there, and uh, took it to the, the other lady so that she could store her chicken and duck food and stuff in it. And, uh, yeah, so that was a, a nice thing. I didn't have to go take that to the scrapyard. Yeah, what's that? Hi, everybody. Well, I went, I got these four pool heaters today. And then I got all of these lights. I haven't, uh, I haven't pulled them out yet to see if there's a, if they're copper or aluminum transformers in them. But I hope copper, obviously. And these pool heaters, I don't really know much about, but like I see there's a nice uh, cast aluminum, I don't know what that is, like a pump, I guess, or part of the pump. But uh, yeah, I'm kind of excited. I hear there's usually lots of copper in these pool heaters, so we'll see. But for right now, I think I'll, I gotta unload them. I'll just take them right into the shop and uh, I kind of got uh, all this stuff pulled up here. I still got to go through. This is all my uh, P-Tac that I took apart there. But after my injury, I didn't do much more. I just got that stuff out. And, and uh, yeah, I think I'll pull these lights up and just start tearing them down. But I'm going to do one first. So maybe I'll just take them all straight to the scrapyard. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, that's my plan. Like tomorrow I gotta go in because I, I got the wrong. Oh, hi. Hi. Um, I got the wrong auger. I got one for two people, but there's something something going wrong with it. So I, uh, I guess they have a one person post hole auger. Anyhow, I'm gonna get this, start getting this unloaded and I'll be back. Oh, well, it's half and half. I guess I'll take them apart. I've got the, got the shield, and then this is all cast. I'm going to clean that stuff all up. I don't know what I got. Maybe one, two, three. Oh, I don't know, a dozen or so. Fifteen, maybe. So, yeah. I'll keep them. I was going to... I was hoping they'd be all copper, but might as well throw them in my bin, I guess. Start tearing this stuff apart. Plus, there's lots of wire, and I guess, uh, I don't know. I guess those just go in. I don't know what you do with these plastic uh, um, capacitors. But anyways, that's what I got. And then uh, also get a little brass and stuff out of here. The nuts, uh, I took out a couple of the nuts were brass and yeah. Boo. Oh yeah, I also got um, these. One one's broken, I think. Yeah, there's a smashed one down at the bottom, but I don't know. How you tell? Oh wait, there's is there. So I don't know. I guess we can't really see that. Maybe if I, I don't know. Phillips MH400 slash U. So 400 watt. But I don't know. Like they, he said they were all working when he uh, took them out. So I'm gonna go give them to. A buddy that might be able to use them but if not I don't know what you do with all these I don't want to break them all just to get the brass ends off but I guess if nobody wants them okay so I just took the uh, shields off at 18 all together so I think that's all what they call old sheet but there's uh I don't know, probably 15 pounds of 
of aluminum there. Those are all cast aluminum bodies. And uh, I'm guessing that if they're all, I, I noticed some have black cords and some have white cords. So I don't know if they're, I think they're all the same one. VH400MAKT. VH400MAKT. So yeah, I guess it's just whatever the electrician wired them in with. But um, I'm hoping that some of them have all copper transformers, but I guess you don't, don't know until you get in there. I know that they'll be worth taking apart just because there's at least one small copper. And then I've got these to do. Um, just a second, let me climb up here. This is a different uh, one. The other three are all the same make, which uh, Pantera, I guess, is the brand. Oh, wait, there's the... Uh... Okay. So I guess the uh, PN is the product number, 460730. 460730. And then uh, this is LXI. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, so model. Must be a French. Uh, oh, here's the English side over here. Jandy Pool Heater LXI. LXI 250N. Is the model number so I don't know GCR says that there's a lot of copper in these things so I'm looking forward to find it I don't know where it is I guess it must be in those big uh, whatever those canisters must be like coils of copper or something in there but I guess we'll find out just not today maybe today though cuz I know I get curious, and it's not going to hurt me to take one apart before I take one apart on video, right? All right. Yeah, I knew I couldn't resist. Anyhow, that's just the plate that I cut those off of. Pretty sweet.